Where is everybody? This simple question from the brilliant physicist Enrico Fermi sparked the famous Fermi paradox. The paradox suggests that the likelihood of intelligent life in the universe is surprisingly high, yet we haven't made any contact with extraterrestrial civilizations. Why is that? Explanations abound, from the vast distances of space to the self-destructive tendencies of intelligent life. But one explanation is increasingly gaining popularity. What if the aliens are already here? What if we've already made contact, but just don't realize it? In this video, we'll dive deep into the Fermi Paradox, explore the evidence for the existence of extraterrestrial life, and investigate the possibility that we're already living among aliens. By the end, you might just start to question everything you thought you knew about life in the universe. The vastness of the universe. To fully understand the Fermi Paradox, we must first appreciate the sheer scale and complexity of the universe we inhabit. The Milky Way, our home galaxy, is just one of countless galaxies in the observable universe. Astronomers estimate that the total number of stars in the universe is something akin to the number of grains of sand on all the beaches of the world. This staggering number of celestial bodies raises the intriguing possibility that life, in some form, could exist on countless planets orbiting these stars. After all, our own planet Earth, with its diverse array of life, is just one of the many worlds that dot the cosmos. If the universe is truly so vast and teeming with potential, then why haven't we detected any clear signs of advanced extraterrestrial civilizations? The Fermi Paradox challenges us to reconcile this apparent contradiction, forcing us to confront the uncomfortable reality that perhaps we are not as unique or special as we might have once thought. As we gaze up at the night sky, the question lingers, where is everybody? The birth of the Fermi Paradox. In the summer of 1950, Enrico Fermi and his colleagues Emil Konopinski, Edward Teller, and Herbert York were enjoying a lunchtime conversation at the Los Alamos National Laboratory. Suddenly, Fermi posed a seemingly simple question that would go on to inspire one of the most thought-provoking scientific puzzles of the 20th century. Where is everybody? Fermi, renowned for his groundbreaking work in nuclear physics, had been pondering the likelihood of intelligent life existing elsewhere in the universe. Using his characteristic back-of-the-envelope calculations, he estimated that the odds of advanced civilizations being relatively common in the cosmos were surprisingly high. Yet, he couldn't reconcile this with the apparent lack of any clear evidence of their existence. Fermi's question sparked a lively discussion among the group, as they wrestled with the implications of this paradox. If there are so many potential civilizations in the universe, why haven't we detected any signs of their presence? Shouldn't they have found Earth by now, or at the very least, made their presence known to us? Tragically, Fermi passed away in 1954, before the advent of modern technology that has since captured tantalizing glimpses of unidentified aerial phenomena UFP, which some believe could be evidence of extraterrestrial visitation. Nevertheless, his original question remains unanswered continuing to challenge our understanding of the universe and our place within it. Possible explanations for the Fermi Paradox The Fermi Paradox has inspired numerous hypotheses and theories in an attempt to reconcile the apparent contradiction between the high likelihood of intelligent life in the universe and the lack of observable contact. One of the most prominent explanations is the idea that life, in general, may be relatively rare or face significant obstacles in its evolution. The Great Filter Hypothesis suggests that there may be a barrier or filter that prevents simple organisms from ever evolving into more complex, space-faring civilizations. This could be due to any number of factors, from the difficulty of the transition from single-celled to multicellular life to the inherent instability of advanced technological societies. If such a filter exists, it could drastically limit the number of advanced civilizations that can emerge and make their presence known. However, what if the solution to the Fermi Paradox is much simpler and closer to home? What if the aliens are already here and we just haven't realized it? Disclosure and the Collapse of the Fermi Paradox In 2023, the GOP Oversight Committee heard some mind-bending testimony from David Grush, a former US government official. Grush spoke about the theoretical framework of space travel, including the potential for interdimensional capabilities. If his claims are true, it could lead to a serious revision of the Fermi Paradox. 
You see, if UAPs, unidentified aerial phenomena, are real and demonstrate advanced capabilities, then the Fermi paradox might not be a paradox at all. It could mean that the aliens are already here, and we just haven't realized it. Credible eyewitness accounts. Alongside the potential government disclosure, there is a wealth of credible eyewitness accounts that lend support to the idea that extraterrestrial life is already here, and we've simply been overlooking the evidence. Pilots, military personnel, and even ordinary citizens have reported witnessing unidentified aerial objects, UAS exhibiting flight behaviors that defy our current understanding of aerodynamics and propulsion. These sightings are not the stuff of science fiction, but rather well-documented, verifiable incidents that challenge our assumptions about the nature of the universe. One of the most compelling pieces of evidence is the US Navy Tic Tac incident, where radar data corresponded with visual sightings, indicating the presence of a physical object exhibiting unprecedented maneuverability. These first-hand accounts from credible witnesses cannot be easily dismissed, and they suggest that there is more to the skies above us than we've been willing to acknowledge. The Phenomenon of Alien Abduction Another aspect of the alien contact phenomenon is the widespread reports of alien abduction. Despite the numerous first-hand accounts, these claims are often immediately dismissed or ignored. But why? These stories of abduction and attempted abductions go back almost 100 years, and the victims often have nothing to gain by reporting their experiences. Instead, they are often met with ridicule, doubt, and even intimidation. Psychiatrist Dr. John Mack, a Pulitzer Prize-winning author and professor at Harvard Medical School, interviewed dozens of alleged alien abductees and found their narratives to be highly detailed and consistent, suggesting that something extraordinary was occurring. Government Disclosure and the Collapse of the Fermi Paradox If the government has known about the existence of extraterrestrial life all along, then the Fermi Paradox is no longer a paradox. The testimony from David Grush and the numerous credible eyewitness accounts suggest that the government is aware of the presence of UAPs, but has chosen to keep the public in the dark. This raises a troubling question. If there's nothing to hide, why hasn't the government provided full disclosure? The time has come for transparency, and the public deserves to know the truth about the existence of alien life. The search for extraterrestrial life continues. Despite the overwhelming anecdotal evidence and the potential government disclosure, the search for extraterrestrial life continues on a scientific level. Astronomers are now discovering thousands of planetary systems orbiting other stars in the Milky Way, further fueling the possibility that we're not alone in the universe. The study of alien life has become more complex, with a growing desire for science-based evidence or whistleblowing by credible government officials. As we explore the possibility of extraterrestrial life, it's important to approach the data with an open and respectful mindset, recognizing that alternative interpretations might offer equally valid insights. The Fermi paradox remains a thought-provoking puzzle, challenging us to confront our assumptions about the prevalence of life in the universe. While the evidence for the existence of alien life continues to mount, the ultimate resolution to this enigma may lie in our willingness to embrace the unknown and follow the data wherever it leads. So, where are all the aliens? The signs are all around us, from ancient cave art to modern-day sightings and abduction reports. The Fermi paradox may no longer be a paradox at all, but rather a reflection of our reluctance to accept the possibility that we're not alone in the universe. As we continue to explore the cosmos and unravel the mysteries of the universe, one thing is clear. The truth is out there, and it's up to us to find it. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating explorations into the unknown. Until next time, keep looking up.